My cyber deck quest is finally over. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Sideways. Holding it. I can finally take my phone outside with a keyboard and trackball mouse and I can make things with it. I can use productivity software, development software, anything, and I can finally touch grass. So, uh, I'm gonna go over how we make this thingy. Uh, first, let's actually take a look at the thingy in action. I'll have a name for it, it's just the thingy. So we got our, our mouse right here. The, uh, the trigger right there is the left click. Um, can hold it like a little weapon um, and then the phone you can hold one-handed with the keyboard and put your hands together if you got decently sized hands and look we got Godot here the game engine oh man oh no it's dev work on the Godot I ran a whole test game oh man there's little arrows there too so we can go in we can type our stuff fully featured okay Let's see what else we got here let's go over to TIC 80 which is a lot like Pico 8 um, it has an Android version too we're gonna type in surf and that's gonna get us um, this little on loan repo of games and let's go ahead and just play one this is me playing one well actually no this is me looking at the code for one me playing this isn't a different thing so I uh, can do your music from here so write your music, do your sprite work. Oh man, making sprites on the go and typing in stuff about them. You probably also use like Termix, but I didn't demonstrate Termix. Anyway, so what you gotta get? Um, first of all, I started this because I spent way too much money on a GPD micro PC and I was like, it's not for me. Uh, spent way too much money on that. So, I've got this project here. I buy two of these right here, this Vastar stuff, smartphone, tripod, cell phone holder thingies. Two of these mounts, uh, two of them. And then after I get two of those, I get these right here. Um, I only really need one. It's a quarter inch male-to-male uh, -male threaded tripod screw adapter thingy, double-headed. Only need one of them, but I bought both. Um, then we get this over here, our uh, trackball mouse, the uh, I guess let's say I guess ergonomic trackball handheld finger USB mouse wireless optical travel DPI mice for PC, laptop. Also for Android, it works with Android just fine. So has a little dongle on here, and that just connects over to your phone with one of these little adapters so USB-C to USB-A one of those and then we got the uh, the piece to de resistance um, the re mini Bluetooth keyboard this thing it's great it's the perfect size clamps right on and um, to make this all work we got these uh, washers from Harbor Freight um, you can probably find similar ones on Amazon but I just uh, took my ass out to Harbor Freight. Kind of a kind of a real handyman now. I went to Harbor Freight once. Hmm. Anyway, we're gonna be using this. The uh, was it five sixteenth inch? Um, when he's washed two of these metal ones, and then um, one of these um, from the set of uh, plastic washers. Got this um, cone washer right here we're gonna use and it's gonna be on a uh, pixel 4a got my old pixel 4a still has the headphone jack on it a series is great with calyx os but any variant of android should work with it though then we got godot for android which is a thing you can make games on the go or um, tic80 also play a lot of cool games on the go with this one but yeah, there's like an Android version you can download. So, let's uh, look at the video. Let's check it out. Let's get into things. 
Okay, so those little um, clamp thingies, I, I already took them apart. So these two little end pieces, I'm just gonna toss them. I don't need that. That, toss it. Okay, then, um, got these, we're left with these parts. And I already screwed on the, um, the one fourth screw, the quarter screw thing. It's already screwed on on there. But you see right here, this is why we got to use those washers because otherwise this part doesn't line up right without the washers. So gonna wax off over here. And then here's our little pieces, putting them nicely together. It was, um, 5 16th washer thingies and then our little cone. Okay, then we um, toss those on there as you do with the washers. It's generally how washers work. Okay, there. It's not gonna look like there's much room, but there is. So we're gonna we're gonna squish them. Lined up perfectly. Squish and turn. Squish and turn. And you get this nice little like single thingy together. You're gonna want to do an extra rotation and make sure it's extra tight. That's tight. Okay, that's, that's already tight enough. Okay, and then you can adjust it with the little screws on the sides here. Got the whole set. It's pretty sturdy. That's me wagging it around. Sometimes you get to wag stuff around to make sure it's sturdy. I'm going to put in this, uh, this keyboard in here, turn it on, it's already paired to the phone, screw it on, good. So that's going to be the base point. Then, yep, we're going to put in that USB-A over into that USB-A to USB-C adapter. And this uh, mouse, by the way, it has a side part here where you can, it, it's inside of it, and it has... Um, changes the DPI so you have the the trigger for clicking and the tiny little button to change the DPI to make the mouse move either faster or slower the cool thing is okay there we go so we got our TIC 80 and um, yeah the screw in this part ends a little bit tougher when you're trying to record it and you also don't want to clamp down on the volume buttons too hard that's where your volume buttons are you clamp it just right. Eh, okay, it's clamped. Clamped. Anyway, so, yeah, we're going to put in that part two. Clamped. Okay, see so you can move the mouse around. You'll notice when you type, it may bring up the, the uh, software keyboard, so we're going to change to Android um, a AOSP. Um, keyboard which I've had more luck with it doesn't pop up randomly when you're typing stuff into your code editor or whatever like yeah we're gonna type in surf there we go it's a little repo games and we can just go down to whatever to whatevs um yeah I backed out of that look move the mouse around a little bit you can hold both these together. This is what I usually do. I hold them like right next to each other. Okay, we're gonna do close game. We're just gonna move to this uh, 8-bit panda, which is a little platformer. Get a remember to press Z. I do like mess around with the mouse though, just to see it move on the screen. Got it. Just about any version of Android will will have the mouse working. Anyway, yeah, we got that. Then, yeah, you can type and move around just fine. But then, I'm just gonna close it just to show off the uh, little code editor over here. You know, edit your code, your tiles, your music, all that cool stuff. And let's move over to Gadoo. This is just, again, that same little test game thing here. You just run it. And yeah, um,. I think it's a fun project. You can walk and do computer things at the same time if you're a crazy person. Um, have you ever made like a 
video about this too like um like if you're watching this and you do this you should totally like do a video about it or send me like a picture because i would love to see someone that you know do this in real life like besides me because otherwise like if i walk out in public with this people are gonna be like oh well no they won't actually no one's gonna watch this but anyway uh you should totally make one of these for yourself i'm just gonna call it a cyber deck even though I don't know, that's a broad term <laughs>